where local elections are looming. And the African National Congress is struggling to erase Jacob Zuma's corruption-tainted image. The municipal poll, scheduled to be held on the 1st of November, will test whether the party, which freed South Africa from a racist apartheid regime, can overcome its negative image. Now, the historic party has been losing voters over the years due to allegations of corruption and ineptitude. The party itself is under a lot of strain. Since the end of August, employees of the ANC have been on strike and staging protests, demanding to be paid. The party is reportedly choking on several millions of dollars in debt. So desperate is the party for funds that it has launched a crowdfunding campaign to generate active interest in the sustenance of the organization. In the past week, hundreds of activists converged in Johannesburg from across the country, threatening to boycott the upcoming elections. Their main complaint was that the party selected candidates without consulting grassroots members and saw contenders be selected through bribery. Now, to make matters worse, the party also failed to register hundreds of candidates before an August 23rd deadline, which the Electoral Commission has since extended, sparking outrage among the opposition. Experts say such operational failings come from the party's inability to resolve internal factions. Meanwhile, President Cyril Ramaphosa campaigned for voter registration in Soweto and was met with hostile and angry voters. I'm strong, very strong, rearing to go, to get stuck into electioneering and campaigning. Our people are ready to vote for the ANC so that we can win municipality after municipality. And that is our intention. They are here because we are going to have a, a vote. So that's the problem. All of the time, where were they? We are asking ourselves, where were they all along? For me now, for the past uh, years, I've been not voting, but I realized that if, if I don't vote, automatically my vote falls to ANC. That means I'm okay with how ANC rolls. So, so today I went to the IEC to register. I'd rather go give my vote to another party than ANC. The chances of the ANC seem dire. In 2019, while it managed to win the general elections, it was worst performance ever. A poll by a global research group released recently found that less than half of the surveyed registered voters were likely to cast their ballot for the ANC in the upcoming elections. The elections will also take place just months after the country saw its worst outburst of political violence since the end of apartheid. Violent protests had broken out after a court ordered Zuma to be imprisoned. Protests escalated to ransacking of shopping malls and warehouses, dealing a crippling blow to the economy in what could potentially push supporters to vote for other parties. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.